Uh, welcome to my channel. I'm in Walmart. I want to just show y'all all the produce. I'm going to show y'all the food. The reason I'm doing this, I had a conversation with a YouTuber yesterday, and I'll drop his channel if he's agreeable to it uh, when I'm done uploading this video. But we have so many people on YouTube who are scaring the hell out of people about food shortages. There's no food so shortages. This is Walmart in Liberty, Texas. There is absolutely no food shortages. There are, um, <coughs> they're terrorizing people. Look at this. That look like a food shortage on meat to you? <laughs> How about this? No, oh, I'm making a point. There is all this meat shortage and all that. Is a bunch of BS. Y'all are being roped in by channels who are lying about meat shortages, food shortages, the end of the world, the world's coming to an end. Let me step over here. See, here we go. Cooler full, cooler full, cooler full. Look at all the miles. I'm not going down all the miles. I'm just going to show y'all. Look at this. There is no food shortage. This is people. See, chickens, pork, anything you want. More turkeys. Look at all this meat. Does that look like a meat shortage to y'all? Here's this one. There's that one over there. That aisle. That aisle. There are zero food shortages. Now, y'all need to quit letting these channels upset y'all. There, look. Nice. Shrimp. Look at them aisles. Do you see empty, empty shelves? No. You do not see empty shelves. Look at this. What you see is overloaded shelves. Let's get to this side. Oh, that's all seafood there. It is. Bacon. Sausage. Sausage. Let's see if they got my better boys here. <laughs> While I'm here, let me see. Oh, they got me, my country boy. They got it, but they don't have it like I want it. They have it in these. I don't like them wrapped like that. I like them wrapped like this. It's being picky, but that's how I want my country boys. Uh, anyway, look at this. Here's Al. Look at that. Oh. Imagine that, just all the paper and paper towels down there, look, see? In here, look, there is no food shortage. It's total BS. Now maybe you can't find a lot of here right now. Look at all the cleaning supplies. You have everything that you need. Look at this, cheese. Now, I'm not walking this whole day to go to the store. <laughs> uh, all right, here's more cheese, eggs, even at a decent price, 36 eggs for 356, that's not bad. Or you can get 60 eggs for 587. I don't know where this food shortage is supposed to be at, but it's not at all at Walmart. Butter, biscuits, yeah, there's a food shortage here, all right. Here we go, look. Milk. Milk, 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 milk. Everywhere you look, milk. Matter of fact, fix some bison. Let's see. Hang on a second, y'all. I gotta get me a gallon of this milk that don't exist. I like the older dates on it. There we go. Yeah, I just see I'm purchasing a gallon of milk that doesn't exist according to these people who are trying to scare the hell out of YouTubers. Uh, all the ham. Look at this. I mean, come on. There's no food shortage. It's all BS. All they're doing it for is views and scaring people. Okay, all of that over there is frozen vegetables, breakfast stuff. Air, look at those coolers. Every one of them are stocked full. Okay. And this is some butters. Uh, Cream cheese, whipped cream, uh, butter, biscuits, 
anything you want, y'all, is in this store. So for those of us who are out there scaring people and telling them, oh, it's the end of the world and doomsday, you're full of crap. Eating big old bags of cheese, Jimmy Dean sausages. Yeah. Pork moths. Yogurt. No. There is no food shortage. These are people, I'm just going to hit every one of these aisles like this, and y'all can see. Full. Every aisle, everyone, full. So stop watching those people and allowing them to scare you. Stop allowing them to use fear to get views on YouTube. I'm, uh, <laughs> look, look at that. Hey, y'all, y'all see that? You know what that's called? That's called a toilet paper. Paper plates, napkins, paper towels. This store is loaded with groceries. So, um, all I can say is the other channels are lying just for views and to scare people. Nobody has a right to put fear in people that the end of the world is coming. If you want to know about the end of the world, pick your Bible up and read Revelations. <laughs> Not even half of what's supposed to happen has happened yet. This is Nothing Epic. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and by all means, leave a comment, and I'm out.